Okay. All right. Um, <laughs> I want to say to you guys, welcome back. This is the new full moon segment for the month of um, October. Um, I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful support, likes and shares. I'm hoping that the video went... <laughs> I'm hoping that the video goes good. Okay, this is for the um, hair sign people. If you are a um, Aquarius, um, Gemini, or Libra, this is the moon reading for you because you're an air sign. Okay, so please remember to like, share, and subscribe. Welcome newcomers. Um, this is the new series that is going to go on. This video is going to take approximately 40 minutes. Um, there is a lot of stuff we're going to be touching on for the full moon. Um, you can always receive the full video. Um, um, on demand okay because um, it's a very long a video um, I want to say to each and every person please cross read it is very good to cross read to see what is going to be coming up it is also good to know whether you are a Sun sign or you're a moon sign because that means the time when you were born um, were you born between the time of 12 uh, midnight until 6 p.m. Um, in the evening of the next day then you're a Sun person if you were born after 6 p.m. until 12 midnight then you are a moon person because the clock has only um, well they said 24 hours so um, 12 hours is uh, um, night 12 hours is day okay so um, what you're going to be um, understanding from these moon reading is that after the full moon you always release something it doesn't matter who you are you change your cell you change uh, your white blood cells your red blood cells so this energy that is coming in is going to be positive all right let me tell you what you guys have it's all about love the planet of Venus now Venus is in retrograde so don't take back any excess that is coming in whatever the excess that is coming in do not take them back because Venus is in a retrograde coming out of retrograde and this is not good for you and your exes okay if there are exes that mean they should stay as exes because what we do is each, each and every time that we take back someone in our lives so, um, we need to understand why we got rid of them in the first place or why it was ended um, was it a karmatic situation yes it is it's always a karmatic situation why are they coming back you know have they changed what is the reason why they left and what is the reason why they're coming back so these are the situation um, that you need to consider after the full moon because uh, um, it's going to be releasing something out of your life or something will be coming back and this is what you need to understand about the planetary system and how the planetary system does help you okay another lucky energy that is here um, is uh, the energy of Jupiter and it's going to affect the Sun people who are liberals the Sun liberals so if you are a liberal that was born um, if you're a Libran that was born and this is just so fabulous because I've never seen this happen before so obviously um, the energies are changing so this is this is extremely good because what is happening is that you Librans who were born um, between the hours of 12 p.m. and 6 p.m. Um, what is going to transpire whatever um, conflict is going on um, there is going to be a lucky resolution of this whatever conflicts is going on there is going to be a lucky resolution of this so this is going to be good as we look at um, the Gemini's who are the moon people the Gemini's that was born after 6 o'clock in the evening until 12 um, 12 midnight um, you're going to be getting some little luck is going to be coming in for you Gemini's okay so um, expect that so, now we're first going to be looking at the moon people now the moon people have um, have the energies of Mercury Pluto and the Librans. okay Mercury Pluto and the Libran. so what will happen is that the energy of the Librans are going to be helping you Aquarius and you Gemini's um, and that you're going to be seeing coming up and happening especially when it comes down to legal matters or conflicts and that sort of a thing the liberals are going to be coming in to help you 
um, sun sign people okay so mercury is here and mercury is you manifesting you learning how to turn um, nothing in something you creating something and, and turning it into something very very positive okay so this is what is going to be basically happening it can be um, a relationship a bad relationship that you are going to find a, a, um, a way of resolving whatever the situation is or you're going to be changing something in your life which is going to be very good Pluto is the planet of when Pluto comes up for you guys it is always you know um, removing things that no longer serve you Pluto has to do with deal with the energies of the scorpions and um, hidden um, things it, uh, things that was hidden that you were not aware of okay so whatever that was hidden whatever information whatever secrets that um, was old that you weren't aware of Pluto is going to be coming in and it's going to be removing that okay there's a shift there's a shift and a vitality of transformation that is going to be happening with Pluto okay and um, that's going to be affecting the Gemini now from the Libra have the Librans have faith that endings or balance and new beginnings okay so you liberals whatever it needs to be end in your life and uh, you need to just accept it okay because endings are just fate that ends and balance things and bring new beginning okay so you liberals are really going to be losing something or something needs to be removed from out of your life all things must pass to make way for all new things so all things must pass to make way for all new things so this is what the Aquarians need to understand that things are going to be releasing out of your life so that new things can come in so for you sun sign people it's all about releasing releasing it's all about letting go of what no longer serve you it's all about bringing back balance in your life which is just going to be in a very wonderful positive way and the planet of Jupiter is going to be there so I'm seeing that you sun sign people could be releasing some relationships because I'm seeing Pluto coming in with Venus which is going to be helping you to release relationships that no longer serve you okay this could be work situation and that sort of a situation it's as if that karmatic thing is uh, is now at a close and that is it's going to be releasing that we're moving forward and we're looking at the energies um, for um, the moon people okay and it's like lunary um, lunary and it's it's, it's, it's if um uranius especially um for you aquarians uranius is here okay your own planetary aspect of uranus is here and what is going to be happening and transpiring for you um you um uh, with uranius your own planetary with you, you're going to be having some support from uranius coming in for you aquarians so um this is actually not going to be um a bad month for the people and not uh, a bad um, lunar energies, a uh, moon energies, full moon energies, because what is happening is that Uranus is your own planet, and Uranus is just going to be coming in to help you, Aquarius, along. So challenges are going to be coming up for you, Aquarius, and you could be um, uh, writing a book or publishing a book that is going to be bringing some challenge worldview that is going to be coming up for you Aquarians now for you Librans temper you need to calm your temper the urge of you calming your ten your temper urge is to change with thoughtful plans okay you need to calm your temper and you need to to think before you talk this is exactly what it's saying just think before you talk um, then we have the energy of for you Gemini's curiosity is going to be coming in for you Gemini's um, leads um, the brilliancy of insight so for you Gemini is just going to be extremely um, positive it's going to be a powerful powerful full moon for you Gemini's because what that is going to be doing is illuminating you in a very very positive way so um, wonderful energies then we have because you Gemini's are here you um, Gemini's you moon Gemini's you Gemini's that were born in the night you're up 
in this month of October after this full moon of this full moon of October you are here you're standing and there's some luck that is going to be coming in for you Gemini's now Saturnus is here and Saturnus what what is happening with you you Gemini have to find discipline in your overstimulated mind because you're Gemini you Gemini your minds are always going like at feet at speed fast speed fast speed you live in your mind you are one of the you air sign you Gemini as an air sign that's what you do um, you live in the mind the thinking and the liberals they live in as talking okay they they will question everything and the Aquarius is more of the more creative psychic um, energy of um, you guys and for you liberals what is coming up is that do not let fear immortalize you to move on okay so it's as if some of you want to move on some of you decided that I need to move on but it's as if because of fear you're so immobilized that you can't see your way out and this full moon is going to be bringing that because Jupiter is here with the Gemini's who are going to be helping you guys to remove this um, sort of a situation and it is going to be okay so um, basically don't worry about this because it's, it's, it's really going to be okay uh, remember with with Venus and Jupiter this could be um, especially for the Librans the Librans and the Gemini's Venus and Jupiter is is, is, is is going to be supporting you in this full moon because um, Jupiter is going to bring you some luck in love so the Librans and the Gemini expect um, surprise um, luck coming up in love for you because um, you're both sharing the luck that is coming in you Gemini's and Librans okay so um, this is wonderful this is good this is positive and it's good um, um, and, and someone asks me um, why is it just um, you're going by energies and you're going by air sign and you guys are like sisters and brother under this um, underneath your zodiac air sign and what is happening is that um, when we um, have all of you together then you both know who is going to be coming in and helping you and this is going to be positive okay guys alrighty um, so um, for the people who um, would like to see the extended of this reading please use the link um, below to go to the on-demand page and I'll see you guys